Hey Jason, Hayden here at Pacific Toyota, mate, giving you the personalized high definition video tour of our 2014 diesel RAV4. Uh, mate, before I run through the uh, the RAV4 itself, what I thought I would do is show you who Pacific Toyota are. So if you haven't been to Cairns before, this is us up here. Mate, here at Pacific Toyota, we actually have two premium used car locations. Now between the two sites, we generally stock in excess of about 180 to about 220 vehicles at any given time. Um, so mate, this is our, uh, our city site. Um, so we're located about five kilometers from the Cairns Esplanade, which is just out here in front of me. Um, but if we follow Mulgrave Road, which is just behind me, about two kilometers into the suburb of Bungalow, uh, mate, you will come across our secondary site, as well as our two brand new showrooms. So we have Toyota and Lexus up there, and we also have our service and our spare parts department directly behind them. Uh, about five kilometers around the corner also from there uh, we have Hino trucks opposite lock full drive accessories and Coral Motors So mate, uh, to give you an idea. We are the uh, number one pre-owned uh, Vehicle department for Toyota in Queensland and we're the fifth largest in Australia um, But mate without further ado, we'll run through the uh, the video of the RAV4 for you So to, I guess to give you an idea of what I'm about to do. Um, basically, it's a high-definition video tour um, we show you through all the paint and panel. Um, mate, we pretty much work around the, the whole exterior of the vehicle. Um, mate, we show you through all the interior, all the service history, pretty much everything you'd, I guess, expect to see when uh, walking into a dealership. Um, so mate, I'm just gonna pop the bonnet here and we're gonna give you a look in the engine bay. So obviously this one here is the, uh, the diesel uh, variant of the RAV4, uh, which unfortunately have now been phased out and they've obviously gone uh, for a hybrid model now. Um, in the current 2020 models and 2019 models. As you can see, you got your uh, diesel engine just there, but everything's nice and tidy under the hood, which is good. Uh, mate, across the top of the bonnet. As you can see, nice and straight, there's no visible dents and it does have a genuine bonnet protector on, the, on there as well. Uh, paint chip wise, there doesn't appear to be any from what I can see. Everything seems pretty straight through there, which is good. Uh, through the front bar, a couple of really, really minor stone chips just on the bottom there. Uh, those can get touched up, that's no drama at all. A couple of really, really light marks. Oh no, it's just. Oh yeah, we got one just here. And a, uh, another one just there. Other than that, everything else is nice and tidy. Uh, mate, rims and tyres, so they're a factory alloy wheel, um, and they're a 17 inch alloy. And tyres, mate, there's heaps of tread left on them. I don't know if you can see that, that's probably better. Heaps of tread left on those tyres. Obviously, down the uh, uh, driver's side this time, all the panels are nice and straight, there's no visible dents. Uh, and the paint work, uh, paint work wise, um, mate, pretty much equally the same. A couple of really, really minor marks just here, little blemishes. Other than that, really nothing else to sort of go through in there. Through the rear of the car, mate, it does come with your reversing sensors across the base and reversing camera up underneath. Through the back, mate, nice and tidy. I don't think anyone's ever put anything in the back, to be honest. Um, mate, that's probably the tidiest boot I think I've ever seen um, in my uh, my time of selling cars. Um, obviously, spare tire underneath, jack and tools are all in there. Across the tailgate, everything's nice and tidy. There's no marks or anything like that, which is good. Down there. Roof, again, all nice and straight, no visible dents down there. And then we're just gonna work our way, obviously, down the passenger side this time. A couple of tiny little marks. We've got one there and another one just there. But other than that, everything else is nice and tidy. And again, mate, no visible dents. Um, and any of the panel work there, which is good. 
So mate, that pretty much concludes the exterior of the vehicle and look for a 2014 model. Mate, I don't think I've, uh, I've actually seen a better conditioned car uh, for the age of it. Um, there's really not much I can point out um, around the exterior. So mate, we'll jump into the second row of seats now. Show you through here. Obviously through the second row, mate. Again, nice and tidy. There's no stains and there's no rips or tears in any of the seating there, which is good. Um, and then we'll jump into the driver's seat now. Show you through all there. Uh, obviously, you do have uh, genuine um, weather shields as well on top. Jump in. We do have two remote keys for the vehicle. They are genuine. As a diesel engine should sound, which is good. Uh, mate, current kilometers on the vehicle, we have 62,448K showing on there. Uh, instrumental wise, everything's at your fingertips these days. So all your stereo and uh, all your Bluetooth controls, and then all your cruise control. Uh, your push button start, uh, your downhill assist, traction control, adjustable headlights, and then side mirror with a power fold option. And then all your window controls are just on the side there. Uh, into our infotainment system, uh, again, linked up with a reversing camera, as you can see. Um, but uh, all full Bluetooth audio. Um, we'll jump into our audio system. Turn it up. So as you can hear there, all the speakers are working nicely. There's no distortion or anything like that. Uh, we do have uh, dual zone climate control as well. So each side can have their ideal temperature. Oops, me in the way. Moving down two 12 volt auxiliary ports, the one underneath, one on the top, and then USB AUX plus your eco and your sports modes. Uh, this is an all wheel drive uh, model as well. And then all your um, gearing system just here. Center console. And then in our glove box, uh, all the books. So this was a privately owned vehicle, um, semi-local to us. Um, so just uh, an hour up the hill, up in Atherton. Um, so we've got 10, 14, 17, 21, 25, 38, so 30. 35, 38, 43, 47, 52, and then obviously the last one I'm done with us, it's 62. Um, so mate, that, um, that's an exceptional service history. It looks like they've serviced it every 4,000 kilometers by the looks of things. So uh, mate, this car has been in tip top condition. Um, mate, you can tell by the exterior and obviously the interior condition as well. Um, mate, they've always had a dash mat in here from brand new. Um, all the leather's all nice and um, still intact across the uh, the dash. Um, yeah, there's really not much I can go through, unfortunately, with this vehicle. It's, um, well, I'd hate to say, it's almost like a new car. Um, so, we'll jump out, we'll give you a final look over the vehicle. Now, um, obviously, having two keys and a full service history and past its independent background uh, check, um, mate, uh, this car will qualify for Toyota certification as well. Um, I can go through that uh, in depth a little more with you. Um, but uh, mate, all in all, that is the 2014 GXL uh, RAV4 um, in the diesel variant. Uh, mate, I hope you enjoy the video. If you do have any further questions though, please don't hesitate to give me a call. But I uh, look forward to hopefully doing business with you very soon. Thanks mate.